Firehouse Strategies released a poll which surveyed general election likely voters across Wisconsin, Pennsylvania, and Michigan, three key swing states that Donald Trump won during the 2016 presidential election. The survey found that Trump's loses, or polls neck to neck, when put up against three high polling 2020 Democrat presidential candidates, former Vice President Joe Biden, Sen. Bernie Sanders, IVT, and former Representative Beto O'Rourke, D. Texas. Firehouse polled 1,778 likely voters in those three states between March 19 and March 21, and the margin of error amounts to four. One in Wisconsin, 4.5 in Michigan, and 4.1 in Wisconsin. In Wisconsin, Trump loses against the three 2020 Democrat presidential candidates selected by Firehouse. If the election were held now, Donald Trump would gain 40% of the vote against Biden's 53%, Trump would receive 41% support against Sanders' 48%, and Trump would get 42% compared to O'Rourke's 45%. The Firehouse survey suggests that Trump would fare better in Michigan compared to Wisconsin. Trump would receive 46% support amongst likely general election voters compared to Biden's 45%, Trump would receive 46% support against Sanders' 45%, and Trump would best O'Rourke by nearly double digits, with Trump at 48% and O'Rourke at 39%. Pennsylvania voters also suggested they would back Biden who hails from Scranton, Pennsylvania, in a matchup between the former vice president and the sitting president. Biden would receive 50% support, Trump would gain 43% support, while Trump and Sanders would tie at 44%, and Trump would beat O'Rourke by 7.47% to O'Rourke's 40%. Firehouse strategies emphasize that Biden remains the strongest Democrat candidate when compared to Bernie and O'Rourke and perform best against Trump in Wisconsin. Even though Trump garnered strong enthusiasm in these three swing states in 2016, Firehouse's survey suggested that Trump's job approval polling dipped to the 40 percent range in each state, and on average, 51 percent of voters in the three states disapprove of the president's job performance. However, the poll suggests that Americans who voted for Barack Obama in 2012 and Trump in 2016 will still overwhelmingly back the president in 2020. In Michigan, 84% of Obama-Trump voters choose Trump regardless of whether they could pick Biden, Sanders, or O'Rourke. In Pennsylvania, 70-79% support Trump depending on the matchup. Biden would steal more Obama-Trump voters and O'Rourke would steal the least amount of voters from Trump. In Wisconsin, roughly two-thirds would vote for Trump again over his Democrat opponents. The Firehouse poll arises as two Emerson polls found that Biden would fare best in both Iowa and across the nation, where Sanders would place rank second amongst Democrat voters. President Donald Trump said he would love to run against Biden, Bernie, and former Rep. Beto O'Rourke, D. Texas. I wouldn't mind. I mean, I'd love to have Biden. I'd love to have Bernie. I'd love to have Beto, Trump said in a recent interview. I mean, Beto seems to be the one that the press has chosen. The press seems to have chosen Beto, 